Yo, we're running out of shit to do in this game. Are we? Yeah, we're almost done. Let's go fucking get Luigi. Oh, yeah. Mario, I was hanging out with some of my grown-up friends again, and I got lost. I don't know what happened. Luigi! You... What are you doing? Are you... You can't be drinking with your friend! Dear God, Alex. Just come get me, okay? <laughs> Lately, you're not my dad, Mario. <laughs> Mario, you're not my father. Guys, welcome back to Beard Bros. <laughs> Where we clearly lost our, our father died, a good man, Luigi! Yo, that'd be an interesting story to find. Mario's dad, like an old- Like, like the like, origin story of, Ma of Mario's father? Like an old plumber with brown overalls? Yeah, but knowing Nintendo, they'd make him like a part of the main staple. Giuseppe? Giuseppe, it's a horrible father's name. What would you name Mario and Luigi's father? Uh, Dominique de Coco. Dominique de Coco. <laughs> No, I had to. Had to <laughs> You're just making noises with your mouth. I'm referencing the Academy Award winning film, Inglorious Bastards. Oh, I know you are, but it's just, it's not. Accurate. It's not about that at this point. <laughs> or Lami. So you're just, <laughs> you're just making noises. Like, like can you say that again? He's like, Or Lami. It's not as messed up as you're saying. <laughs> You're making it worse because you are who you are. <laughs> Mario, please. Don't tell Papa. Question of the day, if you could name Mario's dad, what would it be? Yeah. What do you think? Like Giacomo? I think it has to like be like a EO or an EG situation. You know o what I mean? Oldio. Daddy yes, Oldio. Daddio. Daddio. Daddio is not a great name Daddy for a No. <laughs> Pop Poplio. Poplio, the Pokemon? Poplio. Poplio is Mario's dad, confirmed. Alright. I created Mario, I can do whatever I want. Debatable. Pop. Pop. Geppetto. G Geppetto. That's the name. Marco. Alright, Marco I get. Dominic. A De Dominic Coco. De Coco is not a good is not a great one. Just letting you know. A little in advance that that one is not great. Nicolo. Nicolo? Nicolo. Caesar. Caesar? Rodrigo. You're just saying names. Borgia. What? What about Rodrigo the Borgia? Rodrigo Borgia. What are you talking about? I'm just trying to throw out some crazy theories for Mario's father. What if he's Mario the First? Mario, please! I won't do it again, I swear! Let me out of here! Sometimes I just have to let you go. I have to let you do what you do best. He's just turning into like a really bad Jimmy Fallon character. <laughs> Does Jimmy, Jimmy Fallon have characters anymore? Probably he's gotta, right? Maybe? I feel like Jimmy Fallon is like entering the like the, like, household name phase of his career now, and he has to, like, find ways to, like, make his weird personality, like, work with, like, you know, the people who watch, like, Regis. I just revealed my age to everyone. Regis yeah. has not been on that show for about five years. I didn't want to, like, make you feel bad. Did you hear that they replaced, uh, that they, they finally found a new host? Uh, yeah, to go with Kelly Ripa. Ryan Seacrest. Yeah. Another person who's like, started out like, maybe, you know, maybe not like the coolest guy ever, but like, you know, he was like on the radio, he was like a music dude. And now he's like, a middle-aged man. It's interesting. Alex, tell us some Ryan <laughs> Seacrest facts, please. You want to know some facts about Ryan Seacrest? Yeah. Well... He just got a new job hosting live with uh Fuck Kelly Ripa Ryan Seacrest Trivia. Here we go. This is the great trivia you guys get on Beer Bros. 21 facts about the radio personality. He's born in 1975 or 74. Okay. On Christmas Eve. Pretty cool. Um 
His mother told the Atlanta Journal-Constitution that instead of playing with G.I. Joes or Cowboys and Indians, Ryan would always have a little microphone and do shows in the house. Didn't know his mom was racist against Native Americans. Just what? Kid just kidding. Um... What? <laughs> just kidding. Um, he got his first chance as a DJ when the DJ called in sick, or he was working. Pretty cool. It's like a Broadway musical, practically. Yo, you fucking went after that bullet bill. I did not lead you there. He was like, oh shit, a star. Maybe I should... You want me to hit... hit? No, bullet bill. I can hit it. No, bullet bill. Free my brother, asshole. Uh, none of these are like facts. They're just like his career. What are facts but your career? Uh, number 15 on this list out of 21 is that he, it's announced that he will join Kelly Ripa as host of Live with Kelly and Ryan. Number 15. When did that get published? That's yesterday? I mean. This must be like a pretty fucking new list. Yeah, it was published yesterday. Who I made it? BuzzFeed? Uh, Useless Daily. Pretty good name for a website. I mean, look, they're not lying, right? Right. Okay. I'm going to IMDB. Blah, I thought I'd go crazy. Yeah, you want this powder thought? Okay, if you tell Rosalina, I found it. Yeah. What if... Luigi's, like, getting into, like, he, like, got all freaked out by the ghosts, and now he just, like... Like tried cocaine twice. He's you like, made him that way. He's kind of strung out. Like he just like. Luigi. He's like, okay, don't tell Rosalina. Wallace, come on, don't tell Rosalina. Do you subscribe to the theory that Rosalina is the daughter of Luigi and 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 Peach? No. You think that they're all the same age? No, I think she has nothing to do with this. But I mean, like, do you think she's, like, younger? Or do you think she's, like, just, like, another princess who's the same age as... I guess if Mario's 26... Like... I don't know. Ryan Seacrest was bitten by a shark in 2008. What? A small shark. Oh. A small shark, not a shark. Okay. He owns a sushi bar. A co-owner of a sushi bar called Katana in Los Angeles. Yo, have we been there? I don't know, maybe we can go to Ryan Seacrest's sushi bar. I'm gonna look up the reviews. Rolling Gizmo Galaxy! We in there, fam. It's gonna be really bad. Katana. Mm, 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 mm. Gizmos, gears, and gadgets. Rolling Gizmo Galaxy, Alex. The rolling oh, no. gizmo galaxy. This is gonna be awful. <laughs> what happened? It's one of these ones. Stand up on the ball and roll perfectly to get everything that stands in your way. Katana looks Kill like all it's... the Goombas and take their homes. You gotta take all the coins. You gotta take all their coins. You gotta take all their coins and kill their kids. Oh my god. Seems like Katana's a pretty good place to go eat. It's got, um... It's got three dollar signs, though, so I don't know. What, I don't know. what does that mean? Like on Yelp, it's got three dollar signs, so like, you know... It's expensive. It's expensive, yeah. The food looks good. It's... It's like a... I guess they do, like, barbecue at the table. And it's like a sushi zone. Oh, it's pretty. Yeah, I would like to try this place out. It seems a little too rich for my blood. But let's talk about the rolling gizmo galaxy, shall we? Oh my god, this is just a headache and a half right here. Oh, oh! It's very challenging, according to the wiki. It's possible to make a Goomba fall down from the platform in the second area. Should Mario lure this Goomba? Uh... <gasps> Fuck! You can, like, roll- you can, like, lure a Goomba off the edge and, like, see it fall through the sky. 
I don't care about that though. Yeah, I don't know why. I don't know why that's like trivia. I feel like, like that's just like physics. You know what I mean? It's very weird. All the all the all the other in other names, besides the English name, are like not good for this galaxy. In French, it's called the Ball Trial. German Challenge Ball. Spanish Ball Galaxy. Italian. Sphere challenge. And we got rolling gizmo. Tight boys. Take their tease. I fucking hate this level. Dude, this is just not like, let's be real, this isn't Mario. This is like, you know, a better version of Super Monkey Ball. You have to actually tilt to drive. Yeah. It sucks. Alright, just nice and slow. Don't even fuck around. Okay. Alright, nice and easy. Nice and easy. One down. Clean. Okay. Alright. Clean. This is the Goomba that you can lure off the edge, but, like, fuck him. Oh boy. Alright, nice and clean. Do you have to do anything here? Besides just survive? No, right? Your only mission is to not fall off the cliff, right? Mm-hmm. Can you turn the camera? Mm-mm. Oh my god. Oh, fuck. Okay, okay. I like one more- I like two more full sections. Easy. Oh, maybe it's just this. I think you're there. I think you're there. Just... Just like, chill it out. Tight boys take their time. This is not a hard challenge. Oh my god. God, that made my butt move. Get the fuck out of god, here. That oh made my, my god. Butt move. Fuck that. I'm the best. That What's up? That sucked. Oh my god. What an awful <laughs> level. It made me sick to my ah, fucking stomach. Fuck you, Ugh. game. Oh god, my flesh is crawling. I hated that. <laughs> All right. That's it for the Rolling Gizmo Galaxy. Yeah, fuck that one, dude. Be sure to check out the short ribs at the Red Sun Barbecue at Katana. Yeah. Yeah, that's what the tips is, that's what the tips have been saying. I'm gonna take you there for your birthday. Sweet. I hope I get to meet my idol, Ryan Seacrest. Yo, 100 stars! That's like a milestone, right? Everybody do a shot. Of Coke, or something. Yeah. Everybody do a shot of Coke for 100 stars. Be <laughs> Rose homework. Get a shot glass. Pour, pour, uh, a, a, an ounce of your favorite. Cola, doesn't have to be Coca-Cola, could be RC. Could be Pepsi. Loop de swoop de. Oh my god. Loop de swoop galaxy. Did we already go here? Loop de swoop de. we go here? The galaxy is a great this way, they. How do what? How do? Why do I think we've already been here? Oh no! It's the return of this shit. These fucking this penguins. This is the worst. The movie these surfs three, up. These three the galaxies movie. suck. Challenge Surfing Galaxy Surf Trial. It's literally like the same exact name as the other galaxy, except every time it says ball, it says surfing. No other trivia. Here we go, everyone. No Hope other you like trivia this is available. Bullshit level again. No big deal. It's like Rave, Wave Race Blue Storm. No one bought that game because <laughs> it was awful. Sorry, people who bought it. I totally bought it, but that's because there was like five games. Alright, alright. Ugh. You know what's crazy is how much I enjoyed the, uh, 
the like, what are they called? The Plessy segments? Oh, in, in the second one and in, in 3D World? Yeah, in 3D World, spe especially in 3D World. I really enjoyed these segments because they were a little bit less... You mean you could actually control the goddamn yeah, thing you were they're, piloting? Yeah, they're a little bit less like, oh shit. Oh my god, this is crazy. Oh. God. Ooh. You gotta hand it to Nintendo, though. Like, as annoying as this is. Oh, sh. You gotta hand it to Nintendo, that though. That was the end. Because as annoying as this shit is, like, it could control a lot worse than it does. <sighs> it doesn't give an excuse to make it better. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. But, I can't imagine another company that would even try these controls in a game that so many people are actually going to play. This is the worst. Nah, you got this. Look at my holding the controller right now. Yeah, he's holding it like a... I don't know, like a... Like a sign. <laughs> like if he was, if he was like Wile E. Coyote and he did that thing where he like... was chasing after somebody and he ran off a cliff but he didn't realize that the cliff ended. So he was still in the air, and he like looks at the camera, and then he like holds up a sign that's like, "The ground ended ten feet ago, didn't it?" Like like that. That's the kind of sign that. That's how Gerard's holding the Wiimote. Oh my god. Oh. Question of the day: What else would you rather do in your life than play a motion-controlled level with no railings? What's your answer? What's the worst thing you would rather do besides this? I, mean, I couldn't tell you right now. What's the worst thing that's better than this? Eating a pig's foot? What? If... Okay. Deep cut. If I was like, you could get this star right now, never have to play this level again, all you gotta do is eat a pickled, pickled pig's foot. Everybody eats these in certain cultures. They're pretty tasty. Do I have to get the best time? I think you have to... I don't know. I, I really don't know. I hope that you don't. No. Thank God. Well, why would there be a best time, though? Is there a secret star? I don't think so. Let me look. Just to make sure. I really doubt it. I don't think so either, but let's see. Woohoo! Uh, if you finish in under 130 and you don't immediately collect the power star, a series of sling stars, the first of which is located near some of the younger penguins, will appear and you can use them to shoot around to get some star bits. Great. Speaking of star bits, we do have enough to go, uh,. Get that to summon that Luma. Mm. But we still have another uh, another green star to go do. It'll put us at 104 stars today, which means we have 16 stars left. That's not bad. That's not bad, not baby. Bad at all. We got like two more episodes left of this series, man. We're getting there, man. It's been a long road. Fucking love Mario Galaxy, man. Oh, great Bubble Blast <laughs> Galaxy. This one is Bubble Boy Galaxy. This is still the, this is the easiest of the three. But watch me get your art syndrome. Oh, is this the one with the wind? Yeah. Bubble the electric blast. labyrinth. Oh boy. Some fucking uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles NES biz. Mm hmm. Holy shit. Yo, real talk though. Can we just talk for a minute how good the fucking Donkey Kong game is in Nintendo Land? Donkey Kong game? Yeah. Yes. Which one? It's the one where you hold the gamepad and you like tilt it around and there's like a little guy on the track. Oh, yeah, yeah, I remember that one. That shit, I would play- I wish they made, like, a- like, a $50 game of that that had, like, a hundred courses in it. That shit was incredible. It was the best case for motion games ever, and it was just, like, essentially, like, a high-tech version of, like, a marble maze. It was so cool. Why not get that coin? 
What do I need it for? I don't know. What is it? Probably star bits or some shit. Hoop. Bubble Blast Galaxy trivia. Another section of this map was planned featuring cube shaped bubbles, but this was removed and the cube bubbles ended up unused. I don't know what the difference would be. What's the difference between a circular bubble and a cube bubble? Physics, bro. Would it ma would it matter? That's what I'm saying. I think they're gonna they'd give it they'd give it physics. Like it would like spin or some shit if like if you don't get it straight on the side. Harder to control. Yeah. All these are just called the same shit as the other two galaxies. Ah, the coins are a path. Okay. This one is definitely the funnest. This Fuck. one is definitely the funnest of the three. It's the easiest to control. That's what I mean. Like It's it, the bigger of the three. It's the funnest one just because whether or not you like it, like, you can at least, like, you feel like you're, like, controlling it. Like, it feels more like it's your fault when you die on this one. Getting risky. Risque. Okay. Yippee! It's kind of sad to me that Mario's voice is like digitally, like, like raised in pitch. Is it? It's gotta I be. Th right? I think they lower it. Have you ever seen Trump run it do the voice in in person? He does it way higher than Mario is. Does he? Yeah. I think they lower it. I just don't like the idea that it's like not like a person's voice. You know what I mean? Like, he's just a man. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna- we have two left, with the upper quadrant and the top left quadrant. This is pretty cool. I- you know what? I like this. I think this one's cool. I give this my game design seal of approval. Nice, nice. Cool, perfect. Oh. Last one. All right. Don't fuck it up, Gerard. This is very relaxing. I'm finding this to be relaxing. I'm finding I like this. I'm digging this. I messed it up really badly. What? I almost got us killed. We good? We chillin'? Two lives in like 20 seconds time? Not bad. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Alright. Type boys take the time. Yeah. There it is. Hell yes. We in there. Now we have a whole other section to go to. Oh my fucking god. I just really hope that... I'm pretty sure if I die at this point, it'll just take me back here. This is just like one thing though, right? This is like... Yeah, this is all one... One, one course. big course. Okay. I'm into it. Oh shit. I'm not honestly that scared of these things. Yo, Bullet Bill, fuck up already. Well, I guess I should be scared, huh? I just didn't think it was gonna be so dedicated. I didn't think it was gonna follow me. Yeah, I thought it would, I, I thought it would've been fucked up at that point, but I guess you're gonna. It's it's probably better to just like have it blow up the thing.
He's a killer. Oh my god, he will not be stopped. He's the Darth Vader of Bullet Bills. Oh, okay. Well, I don't know what happened, but they crashed into each other. Beautiful. Nice plan. Yeah, man, I had it all along. Clever strategy. Thanks, man. They Very call me the Inspector because I'm that good. Inspector Fett. I'm the best there is at what I do. And I'm mad at Mace Windu for chopping off my dad's head. Holy shit. Oh! oh. Yo, how are you still oh. here with us? Oh. Pull a bill from five minutes ago. Oh my god! Fuck up each other. Oh my god, there's so many bullet bills, Gerard. Oh my god. Woof! <laughs> Jeez, that got a little tense at the end. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> it was just, just fucking welcome to Bullet Bill Road. Alright. Fuck yeah. So that's it for those green guys. We got one more to do. But up top, and then I don't know where the last 16 stars are. I think they are. I guess we got 100. So we got one more. Yes, yeah, so we have. We have the star bit to go feed the Luma. You don't get one for beating the game, do you? I think you do. You might. I, I just <laughs> think I forget. Yeah. Like I think I definitely. I definitely feel like Luigi has a couple. Has a couple more that we haven't gotten yet. I think that was that was the only one we got that was Luigi. But that's him. What do you mean it's him? He's standing right there. Oh, then he hasn't gone his expedition yet. Do we have to talk to Luigi again? I think it just like kind of happens. How feel? Oh shit! Oh sh! Woohoo! All right. So we got Lumas. This is so much. Like, look at look at his size and look at how fast these things go in there. There's no way he's eating all that shit. There's no way. There's way too many. What do we get? Transformers more than meets the planet. Transformers. I fed a star some rocks. Snowcap galaxy. Ye old snow cap galaxy. Star bunnies in the snow. Star bunnies in the snow. That's like a like a Playboy spread. They don't do that anymore, Alex. Come yes, on. Yes, they do. They're, they they brought nudity back to the magazine. Do they really? I believe so. No way. I'm looking into that. Trivia. I'm looking into that. Bring it back. I'm looking into that. Bring, bring Playboy. When I say bring it back, nudity. I don't mean bring back the nudes. I mean like bring back the 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 true trivia playboy brings nudity back to magazine wow cooper hefner the son of the magazine's founder announced the move on twitter uh they said the way that we portrayed nudity was dated but removing it entirely was a mistake and so as a statement about like loving your naked bodies they added it back to the magazine like two months ago i should subscribe to playboy because it's a great magazine just so you guys know it's a really good cool magazine Oh shit. <laughs> All these names are so boring in the other languages. Yit In Spanish it's called the Snowed Capsule Galaxy. That's a weird grammatical thing. I don't really know what I'm doing right now. I think you're just looking for holes, oh. right? What up, bro? I think you just passed another one, too. So catch that rabbit. Oh. Oh, my Fall god. In. Yay! You'd think that a fucking rabbit would be able to get out of a low pit because their whole thing is just jumping. I saw another one, by the way. I forget Wallace, where I saw it. Wallace, come on! Wallace, easy, come on. Don't do that. Just be a normal boy. Wallace.
Alright, where the fuck are these guys? There's one. Right? Isn't that one that you just... I'm trying to catch him. Oh. And we win. We're just luring them all back to the bunny catching pit. <laughs> That's how my daddy hunt rabbits. That's how I hunt rabbits. I've been using that daddy hunt pit. I mean the rabbit hunt pit. I did not kill my daddy. <laughs> did he throw that? Does it like... Oh. Was that even there before? Oh my god! What? Bunny catchers, what's up? My dad always says sometimes rabbit's gonna be inside a chest. How many how many stars is that for this for this episode? We made some pretty good progress considering that we didn't really have a level. We just got like extra stars. Guys, make sure and check out the Katana Steakhouse and Sushi Bar. Tell them that Ryan Seacrest is sent you. Yeah, tell him. Tell him the. Tell him. Tell him the a crest. Very, a very good friend of the Beard Bros. Wallace, come on. Tell them that that Ryan Seacrest is a very good friend of the Beard Bros. Tell them that, tell me what the Beard Bros special. Yeah, tell them you want the Beard Bros special. Don't tell anybody that you know us or who we are. No, don't even tell Ryan Seacrest. Yeah, if he's there, just you know, you well, know, or as we no, call him, the Ryan. crest. Just Ryan. I call him the crest. Oh, I just call him Ryan because I'm on a first name basis with him. Well, I was gonna say if you do see Ryan C Seacrest, buy him the Beard Bros special, and then when he looks at you and he goes, "What's that?" You give him the. The little subtle nod, the, the little smile. Subtle nod. Give him the people's elbow. No, don't, don't give him the people's. No, elbow. don't hurt Ryan Seacrest. He's a treasure. Give him the people's eyebrow. There we go. Yeah, give him the people's eyebrow. <laughs> yeah. Ask, ask for the ask. Say, I want the beard bro special, Mr. Seacrest, and he'll be like, "What's that?" And then you give him the people's eyebrow. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys. Next time on Beard Bros, we're gonna finish this game up later, man. <sighs>